Hello YouTube, it's Balemore here, back again with more blind gaming today, we're playing Dark Souls 3 for the PC, of course, we're on part 56 of our series, hooray, we just killed the Lord of Cinder here in uh, Irithal, the Boreal Valley, and now we can go up or down, we're gonna go down because I think in the back of my head we're missing a side door, so I'm hoping this one takes us to it, so without further ado, let's do this. Uh oh, this could be bad. Wait, that goes up. I don't know if I want to do that. And that, that looks like a bigger one, so let's take the little tiny dude. above her. Okay. There's a door. Damn it, you stupid latency. Nope, there was nothing special. Both the same place. something like a chest or she's a lord of cinder you'd think there'd be something that's the um, mushy area that was that huh wow how uneventful <laughs> thank you for wasting my time bitch It's like a big um, couch for like a giant. Oh, you know what? She would sit on, she'd slither onto that and curl up, I bet. Princess, I'm such a princess. Maybe that's it though. Maybe this is literally the top of the tower and there's nothing else. And your reward was the princess ring to make yourself a pretty princess. But what's bugging me is I haven't found the side door for that one place. That is bugging me because I've so far up to this point found every secret. So I'm going to pause the video while we um, finish out. Uh, the area because I do want to find that side door. I want you guys to know where everything is, you know, as I find it. And when I do grind levels in the past, I always um, keep keep that out. But I don't do any new content. I want to keep that nice and special for you guys. Special. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna pause the video. I'll see you guys soon. You know what, for those of you who missed it, since we did rest at the bonfire, we've got all these guys. Let's kill them. Let's kill them together. Oh, you got me. That didn't hurt, that was just a knockback. Spider will come again. Well, we got knights. Oh, freaking boy, these knights. There you 
go. I thought we weren't gonna play for a second. So hard. Where are you? There we go. It's not so bad, it's when you get hit. <laughs> You do not want to get hit. Mm -mm -mm. And we got two more knights over there. One with a freaking spear that... Spears suck. This is the other door. But you know what? I could have been... Um, it looks like this should open from another side, to be honest. But um, it may just be an aesthetic. It just looks like, you know, it should be. So I'm just going to show you the knight fights. a quarter of your bar. I wonder what it's going to be like when I come back as a tank. I'm really curious. I, I thought there was one more. Alright, let's run down to this bonfire. Man, we have everything. Alright, hold on one second. All right, I just checked, and you know I go. I, I want to. I want you guys to play these games that I show you. So I try not to show everything. Um, the princess ring that we got at the very top of the tower after killing the Lord of Cinder there gradually restores HP. So that sounds kind of nice. You could just kind of be idle. I don't know how quick the re the restore is. And there was another ring in the zone. This is definitely like a uh, a tanky. Yeah, it'd be a nice tank ring. Um, it sucked HP from dead foes, so every time you killed somebody, you're guaranteed health back. Where that other ring we found earlier in the game, um, there was a chance that you would get health when you hit. So in the fight with all the uh, the priests, you know, that big clump of them, you could sit in them and just whirlwind. Kind of like Diablo 3 where you wear a whirlwind barb. Just do this. So if you go back and watch that boss fight, I don't remember the name of the boss, but it's the one with all the priests in the Cathedral of the Deep. Um, I just, I got hit a lot, and I took no damage. Well, I took damage, but I was healing immediately because there were so many I was hitting. And chances are in this game, and I chose not to equip it, is because um, you don't usually fight a ton of enemies at once, so I didn't think it was worth it. There's so many other rings out there. But anyways, guys, um, we're going to clip it here. And I was going to actually just not do this video, but I decided while I was uh, recording to do it because the princess rings there and shows the top of the tower. And you get a view for everything else. And I show you the night fights again. But this area is very, very short. Just, uh, excuse me, kind of a, a little mini boss section and uh, the boss. Anyways, guys, like, comment, subscribe, share, and or donate. Hope to see you next time as we go to the Irithyll Dungeon and, uh, you know, go from there. I have no idea what's left. Um, we do have that secret area above Lothric, the high wall of Lothric, but I don't want to go up there quite yet until we're done with the Irithyll Dungeon. So, guys, until next time, as always, later.